We're back. Welcome to another edition of In Hindsight. I'm Ted Alexander. It's our weekly look at the ODU women's soccer program. They're the first ones out of the gates in the 2019-2020 academic and athletic season. We're pleased to be joined by Angie Hind, hence the name, the head coach of the women's soccer team. Coach, first out of the gate. It's almost time to get started. Yeah, it is. It feels a little bit like we've been going a few weeks here, um, and it's really not even two yet. Um, but no, we're... It's always weird when you go first because I think a lot of people think, oh, you guys ready to go yet? And we've already been in 10 days. But no, really, I'm happy with the group. I think they're working hard. They're very close. Um, our practices have been intense. And for me, that's the first thing that we need. You had your first uh, scrimmage over the weekend. Your thoughts on that performance when you first got a chance to go against someone in a different colored jersey? Yeah, I mean, it's always good to, you can test yourself against each other, but we all know what everyone's doing. Um, so no, it was good. I think it was a good game for us. Um, VMI were certainly, um, they were competitive for sure. Uh, really pleased with the intensity that we kept up for a good 70 minutes. Um, I thought we did really well, moved the ball quite well in moments. Our shape got better as the game went on, um, scored a few good goals. Certainly Kyra had a cracker to start with. Um, so really, really pleased with our first step. How important is it to be able to get some film to look at so you can apply the lessons you're trying to teach on the practice field to the games? Yeah, and I mean, we, we film some of the practice stuff as well so that we can highlight it. Because it's one thing to hear it as a player, it's another to see yourself doing it. So no, it's great. Obviously, we spent a lot of time breaking up the video. And we'll continue to do that. I, I like to kind of drop feed rather than just blast them with all this information at the one time. So no, we're, we're picking little themes at a time that we want to get better in. And we certainly won't be the finished article for a good few weeks yet, for sure. But, um, but that's part of it. We, we grow as the season grows. You've mentioned before that you like the depth of this group. And that means lots of opportunities and lots of competition at every position. Yeah, and I think um, I really, really like our team this year, Ted, because I think they've got character. They have some personality um, and also we have quality and we have quality and depth. Um, and I thought we had I thought we had good depth last year, but I think this year if, if things go as we think they will, then we'll be a little bit deeper and we'll look very different this year. Um, certainly a little bit shorter. <laughs> no, no important, more important game than the next one and the next one is Thursday at mm -hmm. Towson. Talk about the preparation between now and then. Yeah, I mean, that's our first game. So whilst we're not quite ready as a team yet. We, we have to be ready to compete and ready to win the game. So so we're, we're getting some of the details ironed out over the next couple of days. We'll taper a little bit so that we've got some fresh legs for the weekend. Um, but yeah, we're away to Towson on Thursday um, and that will be a competitive game. Early on, everyone's sharp, everyone's fresh, everyone's excited to play. Um, so you got to deal with that and, and then earn the right to play. Um, and then we have George Mason. We'll come here on Sunday and that'll be a good game. Um, again, we're excited it's here. So um, I, I'm looking forward to see how we do this weekend. Coach, best of luck here in 2019. Thank you, Ted. That's Angie Hind, head women's soccer coach here at Old Dominion University. And if you want to catch the Monarchs here at home, best way to do it is by getting your soccer voucher books. 25 bucks, you get 20 vouchers, good at any women's or men's game at the ODU Soccer Stadium. The first one's coming up on Sunday. I'm Ted Alexander for Monarch Media.